Frankfurt is the platform for uh, orthopedics in, in Europe. The theme of the Congress in Hamburg 2024 is collaborating for success. I hope that the Congress is going to bring together uh, not just orthopaedic surgeons because we don't work in silos as orthopaedic surgeons by ourselves. We are doctors, we interact with other doctors from other specialties, but we rely on industry to create products, we rely on scientists to develop those properly, we rely on people to evaluate and assess them, and our patients rely not just on us but on a host of other health, education and prevention measures. So I think collaborating with all of those groups can make our results better. EFORT is not an original research organization, it's an educational organization. You want to be treated by the best doctor that you can have. And this is why education is so important, because you as a doctor have a responsibility to train the younger generation to be better than you are. Fellowships are mainly a part of uh, effort education and their goal is to uh, provide exposure of uh, young orthopedic surgeons to uh, certain parts of orthopedics they are interested in. Within Europe people have agreed that in order for the same profession to travel around they should have some sort of the common trunk of training and that's where the European board exam comes. For the first time we've got a document where all European orthopedic societies have agreed to use as a basis for the syllabus for training all around Europe. The aspect of digitalization in orthopedics is, is a really exponentially developing area. Uh, our instruction course lecture was structured by the technologies that are used for it because that's where it starts. So we, we have like uh, an overview uh, about the usage of uh, apps, of wearables, of uh, virtual and augmented reality, of uh, machine learning uh, tele uh, uh, t and telemedicine and data. The vision for the future sh should be aligned primarily with the patient benefit in mind, which is also uh, aligned with the clinician perspective.